Yay, love. Today on the Edgy Veg, I'm going to show you how to make super easy goji berry truffles just in time for Valentine's Day. Make these, it only takes three ingredients, and you know chocolate like is a sexy food. Goji berries are a sexy food, so you can eat them and feel sexy. The first thing you want to do is over a double boiler, add some vegan dark chocolate chips. You're just gonna melt them down. Now we're going to add some full fat coconut milk and we're doing that to make the chocolate a little bit more like milk chocolate and make it nice and creamy. So you won't get hard truffles, you'll get nice soft creamy truffles. We're just gonna mix that in. This is totally optional, but I also like to add just a little splash of vanilla. Chocolate making. After your ingredients are totally mixed together, we're just gonna put this guy into the fridge for about three hours to let it harden up and then we can easily turn them into balls. So just put your chocolate into the fridge for about three hours. After about three hours or overnight, if you wanted to do it overnight, your chocolate will be hard, but still like if you poke your finger into it, like I'm doing right now, you'll be able to squish it. If it is totally hard, you did not add enough coconut milk. So reheat it on the stove, like over the double boiler and add more coconut milk. At this point, we're just gonna use either, you can use an ice cream scoop or I'm just using my one tablespoon measuring cup. And we're just gonna scoop out some chocolate make it into a ball with our hands, and then roll it into the goji berries. And the goji berries have also this really nice dark chocolate flavor that's a little bit fruity. So not only does it look really pretty, but it's like an extra oomph of chocolate flavor. Now after you've rolled out your truffles, you've rolled them in the powdered goji berries, we're gonna put them into the freezer. You can put them in for about 30 minutes to an hour. Do take them out like 15 minutes before you wanna serve them so they soften up, but keep their shape. So put them in the freezer for 30 minutes. Put them into the freezer. And there you have it, super easy vegan chocolate truffles that you can make for your loved one on Valentine's Day covered in goji berries, so yummy. Mm. And if you're looking for a really easy, thoughtful, beautiful kind of Valentine's Day gift. Graydon Skincare just sent me one of their subscription bundles and they just made one for Valentine's Day, which comes with an all over elixir, which I talked about in my Christmas video, which I love for giving massages. So you can give your other a nice sensual massage on Valentine's Day. Also hand and foot relief and my favorite, you get a vanilla sea salt chocolate. Yum, 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 yum. So I hope you guys have an amazing Valentine's Day. Leave me a comment below letting me know what kind of desserts you want me to do next. Follow me on Snapchat and Instagram to see what James and I are doing on Valentine's Day. If you like this video, give it a big huge thumbs up and make sure that you subscribe. Well, I hope you guys have an amazing Valentine's Day. Mmm, mine will be good just because of these. Bye. Hi, I'm Candace. Thanks for watching my video. Did you have as much fun as I did? I had lots of fun. Make sure you subscribe and you can watch these guys right here. Or maybe this one. Yeah, that's a good one too. Don't forget to subscribe. That I made um, and maple syrup as well as vanilla. So just put them all together in a bowl.